Good evening. A car burglar in East Nashville was caught red handed last night, and the man who stopped him is being praised tonight for his quick thinking. Officials believe his actions likely kept other residents from becoming victims. Matthew Torres spent some time catching up with that Good Samaritan today. Matthew, we believe that he has quite the story to tell after this incredible ordeal. Not to call him a hero, rather he was just doing the neighborly thing. What happened last night is a reminder to be careful of your surroundings, especially since it is 4th of July weekend. As a resident of South 9th Street for the past eight years. You see, it's just Nashville. It's, you don't have anything in your, in, your, in your way. Trevor Silva knows he has the perfect spot. Yeah to watch the 4th of July fireworks show. It is a cool spot. We just look right down the street. But sparks and pops of color aside, Silva also had the perfect spot. I wasn't expecting a high speed pursuit. To watch a crime in broad daylight. We pulled on a door handle there and uh, then proceeded to go across the street, pull a door handle down the street, and he finally started getting into a couple down here. Just outside his porch, Silva, his wife and neighbors yelled at a teen as he tried to break into some vehicles. Are you kidding me? Really? He just, I swear, he does this. He goes, like that to me. <laughs> I go, oh. It didn't even phase him. The kid that they did it to was the younger brother of one of our neighbors who just moved to town two weeks ago. And it was like, welcome to Nashville. A neighbor snapped this photo right before. These got thrown on in a hurry and uh, not the best apparel for uh, sprinting. And without much thought, Silva chased after the suspect down to Shelby Avenue. He was taking that turn and I was inside and so when I came up I just closed line and put him down. He held him down until police arrived. I just went. I was gone before I had him down before I was like was that wise? <laughs> it was just one of those. It just happened. Luckily the young suspect didn't have a weapon. That never crossed my mind. It was more the fact that like, I, he was messing with my family, I guess, you know, it's like this street has become that kind of a, a crew. This street may be the perfect spot to a great holiday show, but the wrong spot to mess with. People are willing to step up uh, and watch out for each other. Tonight, the suspect 18 year old Joshua Taylor remains in Metro jail, charged with two counts of property theft and public intoxication. He was wanted for allegedly stealing a car four days ago, just a couple of streets down from Silva. Get this, according to his affidavit, it was Taylor's own mom who reported him to police.